plug and play. A 25 foot cord, one half horsepower delivers a lot of water pressure. Easy to use, just submerge the floating sump pump by the handle in clean or slightly dirty water. Sucks in debris up to a fifth of an inch. Vertical lift to 25 feet, submersible to 23 feet. Gulps water like a thirsty camel, 1,937 gallons per hour. Strong water pressure from the pump cleans the spot cover. So the sump pump is helping me transfer water from where I don't want it to where I do want it. To conserve water as efficiently as possible, the floating one half horsepower submersible sump pump removes water down to four hundredths of an inch. So when the above ground pool or spa gets algae, it's a cinch to remove. Welcome to Eclectic Ideas. Voting has offices in Las Vegas, Nevada to make customer service a breeze. And they have 20 years of industry experience. So stop floating with Voting. We're unboxing and one of the main reasons I picked the Voting is because it had a 25 foot cord and I wanted to be able to move it around easily from place to place in the yard. I'm pulling it out of the box by its sturdy carry handle. This is packaged very well to help it transport better. It's also heavy duty and affordable. It stands a little over 10 inches tall and nine inches wide. There's some good weight to it and it's made of an environmentally friendly thermoplastic to resist corrosion and be durable. And there is a built-in thermal overload protector to prevent the motor from overheating and burning. Since sump pumps often have to be used continuously for a while. Now here is that 25 foot cord and it comes with three included adapters. This is the multi-hose adapter that you just push a hose over this fitting. This is threaded for a three quarter inch garden hose. And this is a threaded elbow adapter. We're twisting one end into the sump pump and it's gonna go upright like this. We have a unidirectional three quarter inch flow gasket right here, see? It goes one way, so the water flows out just one direction. There's an arrow. So be sure it's pointing the right direction and that water can only flow out now. And the gasket's correctly seated here. Now we just need to screw it onto the elbow joint and assembly is really that easy. One elbow joint, one hose adapter, and one unidirectional water flow valve. And our one half horsepower floating sump pump is ready to go for field testing. We chose a three quarter inch GHT or garden hose thread adapter for our standard issue garden hose. We're gonna set the pump in this clear bucket to show how quickly and how powerfully it works. This will conserve water because you can move water from one place in the yard to the other, like our above ground pool. We can water the grass with it. And it is literally that plug and play. Look at the power that comes out of this hose. That's just from the pump. Now I can redirect the water from anywhere in my yard to any other place very quickly with this half horsepower motor. And no more guilt about wasting water. I'm not just emptying my pool, I'm watering my grass. Look how quickly it's taken the water level down. It removes it at 1,937 gallons per hour, all the way down to 400 of an inch are 1.016 millimeters. You could practically towel dry it from here. Let's use the flexible carry handle to lower the floating sump pump into the best way Sayu Spa Granada. Lift by the handle, not the cord. We angle the pump slightly over the bubble jet rim so the pump can maintain suction. Since the pump drains down to four hundredths of an inch, the intake port is flat and low and can get blocked. Look how strong the water pressure is. Since the water in the spa is a bit over the max fill line, let's just clean this off a little bit. And it's doing a great job. It would wash your car, water your flower bed, whatever you needed to do. Pop on a pressure nozzle or a hose and sprayer and you'd really have some force here. I'll just spray on some of this black diamond spa filter cleaner to get the excess grunge off and then give it a scrub. Let's use our floating sump pump to wipe out as many chores as possible in one fell swoop. Why not? Now we had a bad pool algae situation last year and we got the water down low and the folding would have done this job magically. Get a folding sump pump if you've got low-lying areas or puddles in your yard. They've been manufacturing them for 20 years. Stop floating with folding. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.